Hey there, fellow horror maniacs, movie lovers, fellow YouTubers. Welcome back to another video of, uh, of total madness. No, but I've been gone for a long time. I, I can't approve some some short um, short videos with my trash cam painting that I did for the movie theater. But besides that, I haven't filmed anything. I haven't felt like it. I haven't. I've been busy, too too busy with life and everything else that sucks and it's worthless and it's worthless and, uh, and stuff you have to deal with and you know, I, but fuck that shit. Uh, I have a little update for you guys and I, I'm slowly going to work through some piles of movies that I have laying around. My town fair hall, some stuff that I bought from another place. Uh, like, and, a cheap ass DVD haul that I did for like one dollar DVDs and such. Some eBay stuff I bought. Uh, some horror VHS and all. I, I will I will make videos this week and, and get all of that away. But I don't have much space on my card anymore, and, and my computer is nearly out of space, and it's become a pain in the ass just to clean, to go through everything, see what I can throw. There isn't much to throw away, so uh, I don't know what to do. But uh, I have 70 minutes I'll at least to do me with you, so I, that's what I will do. But let's continue on with what I'm supposed to talk about. First of all, God damn it, I just I, this is something that makes me very happy. But because it took me years to actually order from Fright Rags, so I just got my first Fright Rags T-shirt, and it, that just is fucking awesome. I, I always wanted. To Fright Rags t-shirts ever since, ever since, I mean, they opened. Uh, but I've never been able to, like, use PayPal or, or order from them, so... But now I order from their clearance sales, I didn't buy anything too expensive, I mean... Uh, but first of all, I bought, uh, bought a nice horror t-shirt of... The Legend of Boggy Creek. Pretty sweet. Yeah. Like in a box. Yeah. But then, then I bought Slaughter High. Should have been the colors should have been more bright in this, I think, because they're they're too faded. Uh, it's the, the same thing with. Legend of the Boggy Creek t-shirt, it kind of feels like the white isn't white, they are more like a grayish tone, like a more... Uh, I would like it to have a more shine to it, uh, but still I'm I'm satisfied. Then we have this cool kick-ass uh, silver bullet t-shirt. I think it's pretty cool. So that is... That, that's, that's that, those are my Fright Rag uh, t-shirts, uh, the first one that I got. So awesome to have some new horror T-shirts. As you see, I'm wearing this not so pretty T-shirt, but but it's a T-shirt. I mean, I mean, I have to wear something. <laughs> so, but uh, also, I mean, I, some months ago in, in the summer, I got these these like Halloween things from my mother. We, we were cleaning out the garage and selling some comics and such. So, uh, but as you see, I got some pumpkins, pumpkins and such, like candles and, and things like that. And Halloween is closing in. Halloween is really close, so it's getting time for that that uh, holiday fun, Halloween fun, and carving pumpkins and eating pumpkin seed, drinking some pumpkin ale or whatever you can find, uh, drinking punch out of the giant pun pumpkin, uh, watching horror movies and and more and more burning candles. And there's so much cozy wonderfulness to enjoy. The smells and everything. I mean, let's oh, let's move on. Uh, also, got, I don't know what to do with this, but it's a pumpkin, so because I did I show this little skull thing. Also, some other Halloween stuff. Some silly pumpkin thing to hang up. I <laughs> I probably won't do it. I don't know. Uh, then like a big pumpkin. Eh. Yeah, they just fold together like this, like a. Lantern lamp thing. Uh, yeah. So that's it. But now to the other part of my update. Did some movies. I actually have some sp very special 
VHS tapes here, but not only VHS tapes, I guess on DVD, but that's another whole other section. First of all, I always wanted these two, and I bought them from a fellow YouTuber called Satan Pain. Uh, Bjorn, also a guy from Sweden, uh, many, some of you know him, I know Mark knows him and such, but he's a fellow, a fellow YouTuber, um, a fellow Swede. Uh, and he was selling some stuff because he needed some money for something else. Uh, uh, but uh, yeah, our fellow Swede, Satan Pay, check him, check his YouTube channel out. Uh, he's a he's a nice guy. I mean, I, and I can't believe he so, so, sold me these. Uh, but the first one he sold me was the Sleeper, and I've been wanting this edition for a long time. I and I couldn't believe that he had it and wanted to sell it. I think I got it for a good price. It was worth it. As the sweet, kick-ass red VHS tape. Now, and the DVD. I have not yet watched this. I, I could have watched this months ago, but I have not had time to uh, be busy. Uh, then we have the basement. Fucking cool. There's a VHS tape in here, and there's a DVD with, uh, let's say, how many movies are there? Uh, five movies. There's five cheesy shot on video movies on this. The basement. Look at this fucking. It's kick ass. I mean, this is a great display item. The sleeper is also a great dis display item. So, I can't believe I, I, I bagged these, man. This is so fucking awesome. So, fucking... This is sealed. It's not open yet, so I don't know if I will open it, but... At the same time, I want to check these movies out. Uh, heard bad things and good things about them. Uh, from reviews I've seen. Then we have some more VHS tapes here. Uh, picked up the. Also, I also bought the, these from Bjorn Saint and Pay. Uh, we got the Black Cat on gold VTC. Fucking awesome, awesome VHS tape. I need to exchange this case here, but I have extras. Uh, then we have fucking awesome movie. I have not seen this in years, uh, many years. Uh, Superstition. Yeah, great. Also, VTC gold tape. Uh, then, a Bob Clark classic movie. Fucking awesome. I got Death Dream on VHS. I mean, look at this fucking sweet VHS. Uh, this is this is sweet. I don't know how much you can see, but I think it looks great. Fucking awesome. Then, one of my, my favorite movies of all time uh, with Linda Blair. Uh, Savage Streets. A white VTC tape. So yeah, fucking awesome. So I got that. I really like this movie a lot. Then we got uh, Fright Night 2, actually. On VHS. Another great vampire flick. Uh, I mean, these are... Fright Night 1 and Fright Night 2 is two of my favorite vampire movies of all time. And some of my favorite 80s movies, so... Fucking awesome. So Fright Night. The Fright Night on... On transfer, because we had a Swedish label that released the VHS tape that was called Transfer. So yeah. Now, th those were the horror VHS tapes. And now on to something else. Some Spaghetti Western. So fucking awesome it Italian Spaghetti Western stuff. Um, first of all, uh, this is a pile of... Uh, not disappointment and good stuff, but it's also a pile of disappointment. There are some editions here that really disappointed me, uh, and yeah, destroyed my day, sort of, because I thought it would be better than it was, but uh, I know it was too good to be true. The, the, the prices were pretty good, it wasn't too expensive, it wasn't too cheap either, but it still was... Oh, let's move on. <clears throat> First of all, picked up this pile of spaghetti western stuff, and I thought that every one of them would be nice, like these first nice uh, slipcase editions as you see they have a like nice slipcase cover with a DVD in it they pull out like this and it looks pretty sweet the only thing that's, that's wrong with him really is uh, the, the, the Thai language on it but it doesn't bother me it's, it still looks sweet and the, the, the transfer is it's okay it's okay uh, it looks pretty good the most of them are white screen so yeah uh, 
this appears to be, I think many of them are uh, the, the, the version that you would like, the uncut ones, or the, the cut, <laughs> the most are uncut ones, what the hell you to exchange this DVD case. But first of all I got to have a good funeral Sartana. I've been wanting all of these Sartana movies for a long time, I really want to, I want to have them all, I want to have all Sartana, all Django, and all of those. So I got that one with the uh, Gianni Garco. Uh, then we got Wanted uh, Satana Price of Death. So you got Price of Death here. Also with a nice slick cover and all. Uh, then we got Satana Angel of Death. Yeah, you're sweet. Then we got another one Run Man Run. Nice slip case here. So so some good ones. Now we come to good movies but disappointment. I thought this was go going to be like these nice slipcase ones, and uh, the, even the pictures show that they were. They, they looked like they were slipcase editions, but they weren't. They all looked like this, like little thin. I don't know what. But the problem isn't that they are thin. It's the way that they are packaged and the. The way the package are made. So I think I'm going to get the camera and show you this because you really want to see this. See, I don't got m that much time left, but I will do my best here. Uh, like I see, I got pretty nice titles. I got like the few Satan is coming. Uh, if you meet Satana, pray for your death. Pretty sweet. Let's see. Uh, Django and Sartana. God damn it. Uh, Django Spara Primo. Uh, I am Sartana. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Uh, uh, I mean, nice movies. But. The editions. Oh, this fucking. This is. Let's see here. This is how they package, package this. Oh, get that. Oh, the DVD is loose. I don't know if you can see, but. This is fucking damage to hell. I played it and it, it stops a little bit here and there and, you know, skips things and... Oh, such a disappointment. And all of them are like decent because they are packaged in this fucking stupid fucking greedy bastard fucking save money kind of way. Like this. The disc just lies on this fucking green fucking thin paper loose like this. Then with this over it. And what the fuck? This fucking sucks. Balls! Look! This is fucking worthless! Look! What the fuck? Sheep ass bastards. <sighs> what am I going to do with these? I mean, some of these are probably destroyed. What I would have to do with these if they, if some of them work, I don't know. Is that I will have to do, make new cases and new covers and such for them to <sighs> keep them. Because. The quality wasn't too bad on many of these. I mean, they look alright. But this, every one of these looks like this with this green paper on and the disc are scratched to hell because the way that they are fucking... What the fucking sheep bastards? I mean, this is just a piece of fucking card and uh, piece of paper glued together with this fucking thin fucking paper here. And look, it's, it's not even put... Look. The fucking paper isn't even put together probably. Proper. But this is a disappointment. Great spaghetti western movies. But they deserve better treatment and they deserve to be put in great, great editions. The only thing that's bad is that too many of these are fucking. Some are hard to get and some cost way silly money. So I thought I would make a killing with. Uh, Buying these sheep, sheep, uh, they were pretty cheap. I think they cost four dollars each, about four dollars each. Uh, even this, the slipcase ones, which were good. I, I like these, but I hate these fucking shit stuff. <sighs> fucking sucks. But oh well. Yeah. This is it for me, and there will be more videos. Keep your eyes open this week and such, and you will see some more. I got some piles of movies to show you. But this is it for me. Take care, everybody. Have a fucking awesome, kick-ass weekend. Um, 
God damn it! I, I mean, <laughs> it sounds like I'm angry or something, but I'm, I mean, it's a good god damn it. I mean, I can't believe it's soon Halloween, and we're moving into the month of of <laughs> October and Halloween. I mean, I, I love this month. It's the best, best, best month ever. Uh, so yeah, but take care, everybody. Have a kick-ass weekend. Check out Bjorn's uh, YouTube page, Satan Pain, uh, and yeah, take care. Bye.